The night a train leaves the tracks. This is Caw Collin, where multiple cars went off the rails this afternoon. Thanks for being here with us. I'm Elise Ramey. Now, while a series of train derailments have caused concern nationwide, local law enforcement say this one dodged several dangerous scenarios. Raven Blue has more from the scene. An investigation is underway into the cause of a Lake State Railway train derailment Friday afternoon in Kaukaulin. The fire department received the call around 1 p.m. My guys were here and we just discovered the scene and made sure nothing was going on. Kaukaulin Fire Chief James Burke says six cars derailed. Some were empty, but a few were carrying lumber. None of the cars went into the nearby river. We're very lucky for the people around here. There was no hazmat, there was no fire. Uh, very lucky for us. Very rarely happens. Every once in a while you get a train that gets off the track a little bit, but they just put it back on. Our infrastructure is getting old. They need to rebuild. I reached out to Lake State Railway and a representative confirmed that there were no injuries and no threat to the community or surrounding environment. But the derailment drew many residents to come by and take a look. It just doesn't happen too often and it's once in a lifetime, the kids get to see it. Chief Burke says it's okay to take pictures, but warns residents not to get too close. Don't want them to become part of the problem. I reached out to the Michigan Department of Transportation. It says the railway is a private line and not part of the state's jurisdiction. The National Transportation Safety Board has not been asked to investigate the derailment at this time. I also reached out to the Federal Railroad Administration, but the office was closed. Chief Burke says Old Calconan Road could could be closed until Monday. In Calconan, Raven Blue, WNEM TV5.